Okay, welcome. This is the first video in the buyer series, and this one I take to heart. Uh, this first video is what buyers can expect. Um, it's a very detailed process, and it can be both emotionally and physically very stressful, but it can also be very exciting. So let's just go over a couple things. Uh, first and foremost, if this is your first time buying a house, or if this is your third through fifth time buying a house, you would realize that every time that I bought a house, something else happened or something different happened. It never went the same. And that is true for every case. It never does go the same. It's like having children. We have three of them, and every single one of them, it was different for each delivery. And the same is true for buying a house. So to start off with, uh, you really have two routes to, to purchase a home um, that are the simple terms of purchasing a home. And the first one is you can pay cash. And the second one is we would have to get a loan through a lender. Uh, either way, you're still going to have stress and excitement and anxiety with both styles. However, um, a lot of times with paying cash, there is a lot alleviated from that. And let me explain why. Uh, when you're paying cash, you don't have to give out a lot of personal information to a lender that's asking you everything under the sun about who you are and what, what you're doing and how you're spending your money. Um, so when you do pay cash, uh, that can alleviate some of that stress. However, when you do look for a lender, um, I'm not going to explain that in detail in this series. Uh, that's actually only in a how to look for a lender series, what to look for in a lender, what questions to ask, what's most important to you. Uh, so stay tuned for that video. Uh, that is in another segment. Uh, for now, we're just recognizing that uh, buying a home is very stressful and it, it can be very exciting. And so just recognize that. It, it's okay that you're going to be under stress. We all go through it. Um, problems will arise. It never goes smoothly. Um, sometimes it can, but most of the time something's going to happen along the way. Uh, so it's very important for you to understand and recognize um, how you deal with stress. And that goes into the second part of this. How do we deal with stress when we realize that we're under a lot of stress? Whether you work full time or you or you stay at home full time and whether you have kids or you don't have kids, a lot of it really depends on how you deal well, deal well uh, with stress. And so I know how I can alleviate stress. And so let me just give you some ideas that I have found with clients and myself. Uh, some people like to jog. Some people like to walk around their neighborhood. Um, some people like to sit in a pool at night and, and swim some laps or sit in a jacuzzi or maybe you have your favorite wine. You like to relax under the stars and maybe listen to some jazz or blues. Others like to exercise and lift weights and that's a good way of stress relieving. Uh, sometimes it's just going to the movies and letting everything go. Um, don't, you know, don't think about it. Your brain gets exhausted. So just understand that that sometimes it's better just to let it go and to forget about it for right now and oh that's right I have a realtor and I know that he wouldn't steer me wrong and that he's gonna take care of me and help me alleviate that stress and that's the final segment is me as your professional realtor it's my job uh, to help recognize when you're under stress and help you alleviate stress by by letting you know this is a common issue or this is a common problem or these are common things that are in a home whether you're going through the inspection or whether it's going through closing uh, so while we're out there and while you're out there uh, very excited and in going through the home buying process just recognize that you can be under stress there is going to be highs and there is going to be lows and let's try to alleviate that stress as much as possible because at the end of this the most important thing is that we're going to get you in your home and you're going to be able to make wonderful memories with your family. So until the next buying series, uh, video number two is uh, using current information and gathering that research and data on the website, what to look forward to. So stay tuned, folks. Uh, this is Robert Paquette, your realtor. I hope you enjoyed the video and stay tuned for number two. Talk to you soon.